नमस्कार इंडिया मेट्रोलॉजिकल डिपार्टमेंट वेलकम्स यू इन डेली वेदर ब्रीफिंग द वेट स्पेल गोइंग ऑन ओवर द प्लेन्स ऑफ नॉर्थ वेस्ट इंडिया एंड द वेस्टर्न हिमालयन रीजन इज लाइकली टू रिड्यूस फ्रॉम टुडे ग्रेजुअली एंड इट वुड रिड्यूस फर्दर सिग्निफिकेंटली फ्रॉम टुमारो एंड देन अगेन मॉडरेट इंटेंसिटी वेस्टर्न डिस्टर्बेंस इज लाइकली टू अफेक्ट नॉर्थ वेस्ट इंडिया Uh, especially western himalayan region from the night of uh, 5th of uh, 5th of may so here are the observed uh, uh, weather scenario observed hail storm conditions over the country and we can see over here that some stations three four stations of east uttar pradesh like uh, sultanpur ambedkar nagar have reported hail storm activity uh, at uh, till 8:30 hours ist of today uh, uh, during past 24 hours and also uh, some stations hail storm has been reported over north coastal andhra pradesh over madhya maharashtra over vidarbha and over madhya pradesh then if you come over to heavy rainfall uh, observed at 8:30 hours ist of today accumulated during past 24 hours then uh, Uh, the heavy rainfall has been observed at isolated places of west up over uh, over east madhya pradesh over telangana over coastal andhra pradesh uh, over south indian karnataka kerala and over tamil nadu as well tamil nadu has reported around 25 stations heavy rainfall uh, which also includes 10 10 to 12 stations of very heavy rainfall that is rainfall uh, more than 13 cm now if we come over to today's uh, synoptic uh, systems then the yesterday's western disturbance over over haryana and neighborhood uh, uh, persists over the same region although its uh, its uh, uh, vertical extension has reduced and it is now extending up to 4.5 km above mean sea level that is 600 600 millibar uh, uh, in the in the uh, lower tropospheric levels and the other western disturbance which was yesterday over south pakistan is uh, today seen as a trough roughly along 68 degree of longitude to the north of 22 degree of latitude and uh, then the uh, then there is uh, also we are uh, we are observing a cy- cyclonic circulation over south indire karnataka and adjoining tamil nadu in lower tropospheric levels from which a a wind discontinuity is extending up to southwest mp across indire karnataka and and marathwada and another uh, trough is extending from this cyclonic circulation over south indire karnataka to southwest bay of bengal of north sri lanka coast now under the influence of this scenario and and the weakening of the western disturbance as we have seen that it has uh, uh, weakened uh, comparatively uh, from yesterday and is likely to further weaken uh, by tomorrow so the wet spell over over northwest india is likely to reduce significantly from tomorrow although today the uh, 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 fairly widespread to widespread light moderate rainfall is likely to continue over this entire region of uh, jammu kashmir ladakh gilgit baltistan muzaffarabad himachal pradesh uttarakhand punjab haryana chandigarh and delhi and west up east up and over rajasthan but it would significantly reduce by tomorrow when it would become scattered to fairly widespread light to moderate rainfall and from 4th of may it would further reduce into the isolated to scattered light rainfall scenario and further on 5th of may it would further reduce but from 6th of may again there is likelihood of a uh scattered isolated to scattered light moderate rainfall over western himalayan region and isolated light rainfall over punjab haryana and rajasthan now if we come over to uh, uh, then if we come over to uh, southern peninsula then uh, then uh, uh, the the tamil nadu subdivision tamil nadu and uh, kerala kerala and south indira karnataka are likely to receive isolated heavy rainfall during next next 24 hours although uh, this uh, all these three subdivisions uh, uh, may also realized very heavy rainfall at some station two three stations uh, that is the rainfall more than 13 cm but to, uh, from tomorrow over this area as well like uh, in uh, over the northwest india the rainfall activity is likely to reduce and only isolated heavy rainfall is likely over south indira karnataka tamil nadu and and kerala 
and it would further reduce and uh, uh, there would be probability of only isolated to scattered light rainfall over this entire region uh, during subsequent three days then uh, we are expecting a development of a cyclonic circulation over southeast bay of bengal around 6th of may and under under the influence of this cyclonic circulation a low pressure area is likely to form over southeast bay of bengal during subsequent uh, 48 hours that is uh, that is uh, uh, by up to by up to uh, 8th of may so that's all for today tomorrow we'll again meet with delhi weather briefing for weather warning during next 5 days thank you and goodbye